Hi guys. We're going to install a new build today. It's called Nebula. It's very cool looking and small enough for a fire stick. So let's come up to the gear. Then click File Manager. Click on Add Source. Click the box that says None. Type in HTTP colon forward slash forward slash www dot miniature life dot org forward slash list and once you're sure it's correct then hit OK. Now we're going to click here to rename. I always like my dot and you can call it anything you want then hit OK. Then hit OK here. OK if it pops up here you know you've spelled it correctly. If you don't see it show up here you probably typed it in incorrectly so you can go back through the process. Once you see it here you can hit back and hit back again. Now we're going to go down here and click on add-ons and then come up here to the box then install from zip file. If this box pops up you need to click on settings and allow unknown sources. Hit yes and you can show notifications. Now you can hit back and we'll click it again install from zip file. Find it and click on it and what we want to get here is the Ezerman's Wizard. Down here, the plugin program zip. And now you'll wait for a pop up. And there you go. It's a plugin, so it takes a little bit longer. Then you'll get this list come up. I always like to save everything and the whitelist. You can save any add-ons or repos that maybe you can't get again or maybe they're not in this build. So you can save your favorite things and you can hit continue and the list will pop up. Once you've finished you can click here to continue. Then you can click on the build menu. So they have tons of great builds here. So if you try this one out and you don't love it, there are so many others you can try. They are just filled with builds. Okay, so this one is Nebula. It's Kaiser Nebula Builds. So we're going to click on that. And we can go down and do a fresh install. Hit continue. So there you go, it's 370 megabytes, that's a pretty nice and size. And now you can click install. And now you need to force close Kodi. You may need to unplug your device if it does not quit and then you can open it up again. And look how cool it is. You may get a pop-up to update the build, so go ahead and do that if you get it. If not, you can look in the wizard. And you can see there's an update. 
so the update will be version 1.0.2 as of this video and then you would choose the fresh install. So give it a minute to load up and rebuild the skin and then we'll take a look around. I love the colors in this. The green and the black, it looks stunning. So if you're a fan of sci-fi, you're gonna love this. Okay, so it starts off with add-on hubs. So there's the video add-ons, your add-on browser, and your program add-ons. Next is all-in-one. They have the Pyramid, UK Turk, Atriox, Maverick TV, Radix, StarTech. Some of these might be unfamiliar to you, but it's a good opportunity to try some new add-ons, like the next one, Monster Munch. For Monster Munch, there's movies, TV shows, world TV, documentaries, and chill out. If you click on chill out, you can get these videos of all these different things. There's tons of them in here, so I'll just show you a couple that I liked. Campfire. Pretty cool, right? So you can have that on your TV. It makes a crackling fire sound. If you exit out, hit back, you can have it playing like this. So I think that's pretty cool. Let's show you another one. You can have a regular fireplace. Right, okay, and you can exit out again and have it that way. Let's look at one more. If you click on this relaxing screen savers, there's tons, and I mean tons, pages of aquariums. <laughs> So you can go through them, see what you like. There are a couple pretty cool ones. Uh, let me see if I remember. If you don't like the sound, you can come down here to the sound button and you can change the volume. You can put it off or just lower it. So you can have your own fish tank, which is pretty cute. That's good because of the green, right? I think it's really cool. Let's try one more. There's jellyfish. So go through them, see which ones you like. You could spend like all day doing that if you wanted to. Some are really great, some are not so great, but there are some good ones in here. There you go. I think that's pretty fun. So you want to stop it, you just click on it, come down here and hit stop. And that's one cool thing I like about Monster Munch. Next is Me TV. Then the brand new Elysium Light. TV shows, movies, and tracked. Boogie Box, that's your music. You've got Okie's Karaoke, Now Music USA, SG Music Box, Dream Beats, UK Music Video Jukebox, and The Music Source. Next is Council TV, Boom Kids, Boom Gold, ITV, Mobdina, and YouTube. Then you have Movie Hub, At the Flicks, New from Maverick, Death Streams, Electra Vault, F Society, which is another nice new add on, Spins Flicks, and Placenta. Next is Cerebro. Cerebral Prime, 
Cerebro Strictly HD, and Cerebro IPTV. Then there's System, Skin Settings, URL Resolver for you to put in your real debrid, File Manager for new add-ons, System Info. And then there's Power. You can power off, reboot, suspend, or quit. Next is TV shows, F Society, Death Streams, Odin's TV Shows, TV Heaven, Release Hub TV. Next is Sports Zone, Nut Streams, Fisherman's Friend, Deliverance, Gears TV, Operation Robocop, Planet MMA, Sports Devil, and Motor Replays. And that brings us back to the add-on hub. So that's it for the tour. If you'd like to stick with me, I'll show you how I would customize this build. Okay, so first we'll do some widgets. So you'll go into your video add-ons and you're gonna pick your favorite one. I'm finding Cerebro Showbox to be pulling the most of all the add-ons other than Death Streams. So I'm gonna click on Showbox, Movies menu, and latest movies. So when you want to choose that, you're going to add it to your favorites by doing a long press or clicking the button on your remote with the three lines. And then you want to add to favorites. If you also want to use them for TV shows, you can click on TV show menu and trending, popular, whatever you prefer. You'll do the same thing with the long press or the three lines and add to favorites. Okay, so I have movies and TV shows now as favorites. You can look for something else you might like. Elysium Light. I signed into my tract, so I'd like to look at my tract shows as widgets. So I'll do my TV show collection and long press. Add to favorites. Can also use death streams. I'll do movies and trending. Long press, add to favorites. You can also do TV shows. We'll do trending also, add to favorites. Okay, so once you have all your favorites added, we can go into System and click on Skin Settings, Main Menu, Setup Aeon Knox Main Menu. So here's all your categories. So if there's something here you're not going to use, you can always X out and remove it. You can also change the order of things. So let's see, I think that TV show should be near movie. So I'm just going to move it down. So you can hit down. So there it is. So you'll have Cerebro Movie Hub and TV show all together. I think I'll also put Elysium down there and I think I'll remove Council TV. Alright, so I think it's good like that. So now you have your order and the menu items that you want. You can hover over each menu item to do a widget. So I'm going to start with Elysium and then you're going to go over here to select widget 1. Click on select widget and we're going to go to favorites. So click on favorites. You're going to click on it again and a lot more times. <laughs> you have to keep clicking favorites until they come up. So in Elysium I had chosen the tract my TV show collection. So I'm going to click on that and then you just click right here to use as widget. Then you can click done. Okay, so you can see here at the top that it's there. So you can just hit back 
and you can do another one. So TV shows, select widget one, select widget, favorites, 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 favorites. <laughs> Lots of times. Okay. Okay, so this isn't really showing you. And I know that the red is Cerebro, which means these two would be death streams. You can do this one at a time if you think you're going to get confused. You can do one add-on with favorites and do your widget and come back and do the other one. Um, so let's see. We'll do trending TV shows. And click use as widget. Then click done. And now you have TV shows. And I'm going to do movies. Select widget one. Select widget. Favorites. And click favorites a million times. Okay, so trending movies. Use as widget. Done. All right, I'm just going to do one more Cerebro, select widget one, select widget, favorites, so you get to this list, and for that I'm going to do movies. Use as widget, and hit done. Okay, you can also change the widget style. If you click on widget style, there's list, an extended list, a panel, extended, compact. So compact would be smaller. If you do list extended, let me just show you how that works. And the other thing you can do is hide them when not focused. So unless you're clicking up, you won't see your widgets. So that's a good idea maybe for the fire sticks. You can give that a try. So you can do that for each menu you do widgets. So you can click hide. All right, so we'll back out and I'll show you how it looks. It's gonna reload the skin and let's see. Okay, so there's Elysium Light with my tracked collection of TV shows. That's really nice. Then TV shows, here we go. But I think they look nice and it's really easy to find a show. All right, so after that we did movies. And Cerebro, this is the one that we hid. Just to show you, you just click up and then you get a list come up on the side so you can scroll through movies that way and get info on the movie. So that's a little different. I thought I'd show you guys in case you like that. I prefer the widgets myself. So I'm gonna go back in, we'll do it one more time. Main menu, set up and Knox menu. For Cerebro, I'm going to click on widget. So if you wanna change it, you go back in this way and the widget style I'm going to change to panel and I'm not going to hide it. Then you just hit back. You'll rewrite the menu. And now everything should be exactly the way I want it. And there you go. So I like choosing different add ons to these movies, and then you have Cerebro's own here. So now let's use this menu to do a little test of my favorite add-ons. So this will pull up death streams. Let's try Thor. This one times out quite a bit. So look how cute it is too when it comes up when you use the widget. It comes out really cute. Tons of real debris. I have my real debris in, of course, because it's so much better. You guys should really get it. So that pulls tons of links. Death Streams is awesome. 
So in order to count them, I'll show you the two covenant forks. First, placenta, movies, people watching, Thor. So I like this because it shows you the real debris versus the free. So it's pulling 11 real debris and four free. Then tons of 720s as well. And there you go. Real debris rocks. Same movie we'll do in Cerebro using the widget. So look, it pulled more. Not a lot more, but a little bit more. There you go. RD to the rescue. Love RD. So, I have a video on Real to Brid. I'll post it for you. And all you have to do is go into System URL Resolver and put it in. You do have to enable in some of these add-ons. So you'll go in to Add-on Hub, Video Add-ons, and you want to check to make sure it's enabled. I don't believe you do it in Cerebro. Let's check Neptune Rising. So you'll go into Settings. Here you go. Providers. Enable to grid. So any add-on you're using, go into the settings and make sure, because most of them you do have to enable. So enable to grid and make sure you hit OK. All the gen add-ons, you do have to do that. Let me show you some settings in death streams. Go into settings. I've already set mine, but here you go. Source, sorting. You can set these keys. I put to grid first the best to worst and the second sort key I put quality best to worst so use the drop down menu and this is the way I like it guys so if you want to take a look at that and set your death streams up like that they sort really nicely so there's all the scrapers in here if you find some of these keep timing out you can disable them so here's the name and if it's not working you can just unclick this so that one kept timing out on us. Let me see if I can find it. This one. This one kept timing out for me, so I'm taking it off. So that's all you have to do. If you're hanging on stuff constantly, you can take it off. You can always come back and put it back on. If you want to put in your track, you click here, and there you go. Make sure you come over and hit OK anytime you make a change in an add-on setting. So make sure if you enable the grid that you go and hit OK. Death Streams is already enabled in URL Resolver Cerebro also. And then you're all set. So I hope you guys like this. I think it looks really good. Okay guys, I will see you on my next one.